news out of Louisiana where a man is dead after an officer involved shooting and it may have been captured on a cell phone. Jamie is following this story with more on that. Jamie. Now the shooting happened after police responded to a man threatening an anonymous caller with a gun. And this morning the Baton Rouge community is on edge as they await more details. Protesters took to the streets of Baton Rouge Tuesday night after reports a Louisiana police officer shot and killed a man outside a local convenience store. Police say 37-year-old Alton Sterling scuffled with the two responding officers. An autopsy shows Sterling died of multiple gunshot wounds to the chest and back. My brother didn't deserve it. He didn't deserve it at all. His family is now asking for answers. Sterling's sister says her brother has been selling CDs outside the store for years. Just to open fire, that's not the answer. That was a life that you took away. That was a family member. A video that claims to be of the incident has been posted online. One of the officers is heard yelling that Sterling has a gun just before gunshots are heard. When paramedics arrived, Sterling was dead on the scene. Protesters gathered at the scene early Tuesday afternoon and the size of the crowd grew throughout the night. The worries are that we're not going to get the information that we need to cool this situation down and this may definitely be the next Ferguson right here in Bad News. That's the worries. Both officers have been placed on administrative leave pending further investigation. Now, Baton Rouge police are expected to hold a news conference later this morning. A Louisiana state politician says police have surveillance video from the store and dash cam video from a police car. Neither have been released at this time.